Hi, my name is Brian Jackson and I'm an associate professor here in the Department of Horticultural Science at NC State University. It's my honor to get to share with you uh, as a potential student or as a graduate student, undergraduate student, or whomever you may be looking at this video, learning more about horticulture and about NC State University and specifically about the Department of Horticultural Science. The opportunity to share a little bit about my background and, and who I am and why I'm here and, and the role I take as a member of this, of this department. Uh, I grew up in Lumberton, North Carolina, which is about an hour and a half southeast of Raleigh, which is here at the campus of NC State University. And I grew up uh, with an agricultural background working in tobacco fields. And my family, having been farmed for many generations, I grew up with a love of agriculture. And it wasn't until uh, I graduated high school and came to NC State University where I broadened my horizons and discovered horticulture, uh, which is a vital part of agriculture. And my freshman year, I took an intro course and I learned that of all the commodities, the issues, the, the, the industries, the products, the food, the necessities that horticulture brings to our daily lives, that it was my interest that fit with all of those many things. So I switched my major and happily spent the next 10 years of my life uh, in academics learning more about this discipline that now I get the joy of sharing and practicing every day. Uh, after NC State, I'm also an alum of two great institutions for my graduate work, Masters at Auburn University and PhD at Virginia Tech. Uh, all of my graduate work and my current research is in soilless media or potting soils for horticultural production. So in addition to the four courses I teach here at NC State in plant identification and introductory horticulture, I also maintain a vigorous research program helping the industry and the growers of our state, region, and nation in horticultural crop production, primarily with floriculture and nursery crops.